All right, hey everybody, welcome to vlog number 16. We are high above the hills here in Malibu, California. We are doing a large 30 by 17 pond here on this project. Right now we're gonna show you this day one on this project. We're gonna show you what it looks like now. We're gonna do a bunch of demo and excavation. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and you can follow us through this project from beginning to end. All right, check it out. That's his primary residence there. Didn't quite do too well in those last Malibu fires. This is his office right here. We're gonna put some waterfalls here. This is actually phase two of the project. We're not gonna touch this big concrete section. We are gonna be focusing on this pond on this side, on the other side of the bridge. So we're gonna be handling everything from this side over. Uh, we're gonna be putting waterfalls here. We're gonna be doing skimmer on that side. We got a couple more waterfalls coming down. We're gonna be making a little connection from the concrete side to the liner side. So that'll be interesting. And then we're gonna just dam this up, kind of leave this as B. We're gonna hit this on uh, phase number two. It smells like money. Yeah. <laughs> what a perfect house for a water feature vlog and a house surrounded by water features. So let's check out the front real quick. We did not build this, but I feel the vibe that the architect is working with on this. This will be one of the phases we come through and we'll probably do a little clean up, make the edges a little more natural. Uh, you know, there's a lot of potential in these planter areas. You just got to get rid of the pearl necklace look with the rocks, but you know, the filtration system looks like it's going to definitely get a boost because the cool thing about this is the pond that we're putting in in the back on that side of those glass doors is going to be feeding into this pond. So we're going to get some extra filtration with our wetland filter. So we're putting a wetland filter on this. It's a 30 by approximately 17 foot wide pond. We're putting a pretty big wetland filter on top of it to hand the, handle the biological filtration. So let's check it out. It's like we're up here in the clouds. Can't really see the ocean, but what a spot. So, whoa, what's up boys? All right, almost no water in there. <laughs> All right, so they're playing in the mud today. We're getting all this kind of cleaned out. We got a little makeshift dam going on here. We're gonna do something a little more permanent today. But this pond has all kinds of tricks. It goes through to the other side here, to the other side of the house. We're actually gonna be changing that skimmer out. There's an existing pool pump on that side. It's gonna be sending the water around, coming through this side. We're gonna have a big wetland filter on that side with some nice falls, giving the water plenty of oxygen. We're gonna be doing a little connection from the concrete to the liner on this side. So that's always an adventure. Hit the subscribe button. There we go. Subscribe, subscribe. There we go, subscribe, subscribe. Then you can follow along, see this project come to fruition, see other jobs that we do, get little sneak peeks in people's backyards, some crazy burnt down mansions like that. So. I got an amazing team, man. These guys are so awesome. They got this place under control. They didn't even need me here. If I'm here, I slow them down. They know what to do. So I'm gonna shoot out of here. I actually just got a call from a client up in the hills in Beverly Hills and way up on the top there. So we're gonna go from one mountaintop to another. And we're gonna check out their Long Palmas waterfall that we finished about a month ago. From what I understand, it needs a couple little tweaks. So we're gonna check that out and then go from there. here taking a look at this water feature looks unbelievable as you can see they got all the planting done around the outside and all the flowers are blooming it just looks incredible this is gonna be a phase one of a two-phase project we have a little pool being built over here so we're gonna have a, a new waterfall start origin point up here on the top we're gonna kind of mix in a little bit of what's going on on the natural 
and a contemporary because the pool's very contemporary. You got to check this out. Big old infinity edge swimming pool looking on Century City down there. All right, so we're back here in Porter Ranch. We're gonna go back and take a look at the pond. It apparently has water in it now. It's been running for a few days. So let's go back and check it out, see how the guys did. It came out awesome. I'm super excited about this pond. Obviously, it still has the bridge to put in, the finished landscape to do all around it, but it looks awesome. It's four feet deep. It's plenty of room for the koi fish down in there. He's gonna be bringing those in after everything gets landscaped, all the hardscapes gotta be done. Honestly, there's a lot of jobs I get to and I think, oh, I wish I would've turned that that way or turned this this way. I haven't found a rock on this project that I would move. I love how they set all these. Chewy, Mauricio, Rolo, and George, the guys just did an amazing job on this project. I couldn't be prouder. I feel like a proud dad. We're gonna shoot out to Malibu right now and see how those guys are doing. All right. All right, so it looks awesome out there at Porter Ranch. We are now here in North Malibu going to check on the guys and see how they're doing with this big koi pond. So this house is actually designed in the center of a natural pond all the way around it. All the rooms come out to some sort of pond or water. Uh, they have this concrete situation going on, which we'll address down the road. So it's basically concrete on top of a 45 mil liner. And it seems to be holding now that we've repaired the section over there in front. Beautiful. I was wondering where all the rocks were. No way. <laughs> Good thing we're vlogging this. I think it always happens, huh? Whenever I'm filming, rock goes down the hill. <laughs> These guys get nervous, they're on film, and the rock goes down the hill. Anyways, it's all working out. We're gonna be out of this place in a couple days. We're gonna have water in there. What do you think? This thing gonna look pretty good, Chewy? Oh, yeah. Uh huh. We're gonna make water for here. Yeah. Go that way. Gonna make, make like a island in, in the middle. Nice. And then another one here. Yeah. So they have this look going on everywhere, as you can see, all in the back. So it's like an architectural design that we just wanted to keep and not move. Chewie's working around this whole area. He's gonna make this scene. That was a pretty good idea he came up with. And then we can keep all these pavers the same. We handle the leak that was underneath it because we're gonna raise the water level and actually create a seam so anything that might seep through there or anything is going to go down that's the problem with having concrete right if you're depending on concrete to hold your water in it's just eventually going to fail you know it's uh, uh the earth moves we're sitting up here on top of this mountain with all these uh trees and moving ground earthquake you can see the stucco's got cracks on it just because it's just what happens it's almost impossible to keep it from cracking you can see where they've done patches. So here the boys are, rock number two. Take two, see if they can keep that one in the playing field. But I gotta head out, place looks awesome. We're gonna get the drone up in the air, shoot this place from up top. 
Chewy and the boys got this place under control. We'll be filling this up with water. Que piensa, Chewy? Manana? Oh, yeah. He's lying to me. No, yeah, we're gonna do it probably lunes. Monday, we're gonna put some water in this thing. Get it connected to both sides. We're gonna get the, we'll show you kind of how the plumbing and the filtration works a little later. All right, so I'm just over the other side of the hill from the project that we're working on right now. Um, the client owns basically this whole hillside. He said he's got another property next door with some boulders and rocks on it, so I decided to come snoop around down here and bam check it out we got some big big rocks and boulders here looks like when they dug out the foundation for the house they put all the rocks that they found right here they stockpiled it so that's pretty cool i'm a rock guy so me and him have a lot of things in common we like to collect rocks so whoa pretty cool so it goes right down into trancas canyon all right, so we definitely got a huge pile of rock here for us to pick from around the outside edges and maybe some of the waterfalls and spillways. But uh, I hope you enjoyed vlog number 16. We had a lot of fun. We shot from Porter Ranch to Beverly Hills to Malibu out here a couple times. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. You can see this pond get wrapped up, get water in it. You get to see also the other projects as they get landscaping, as they get touched up. We go back years later and check out some of these ponds and waterfalls. So see ya, till next time. Oh, 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 oh,